Joe followed her back to the entry, but paused quietly at the parlor door, watching her. The bell rang a second time, just as Danielle was about to open the door. The man Danielle found standing on her front porch was nothing like she expected. For some reason, she had imagined that Chris Johnson, assuming that was who this man was, would be more in line with Will Wayne, an older gentleman, alone and seeking company for the holiday. This man, whom she guessed was close to her age, perhaps a little older, looked like someone who would be spending his Christmas vacation on a cruise ship with other singles instead of tucked away in a little bed and breakfast on the northwest coast. And considering his looks, Danielle imagined he wouldn't be lacking the attention of the women. She couldn't wait until Lily got a look at this one. Dressed in faded jeans, a powder blue dress shirt and suede jacket, the man carried a duffel bag over one shoulder. He broke into a wide smile the moment his eyes met hers. His gaze swept over her and his smile broadened. Well, hello, he greeted her, his blue eyes twinkling. I sure hope I'm at the right place. I'm Chris Johnson. I have a reservation. This is Marlowe House, isn't it? I didn't see a sign. Danielle opened the door wider and stepped to one side. You're at the right place. Welcome. I'm afraid we don't have a sign yet. I'm your host, Danielle Boatman. Chris put out his hand and shook the one Danielle offered as he made his way into the house. Once inside, he glanced around and immediately spied Joe standing to one side, silently watching. Hello. He flashed Joe a smile. Are you Mr. Boatman? <laughs>